Subscribe GA. Hello everyone, and welcome to my General Hospital official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. During Nina and Sunny's wedding, Ned's memories resurface. Is the marriage doomed because Eddie has left? According to General Hospital, GH, spoilers, Eddie Main, alias Ned Quartermain, Wally Kurth, will be drawn to Sonny Corinto's, Morris Bernard, and Nina Reeves, Cynthia Watros, in the upcoming episodes. Sonny will assist Eddie begin his music career in addition to letting him reside at his home as long as he stays in Port Charles. That will be very important to Eddie, as he attempts to understand his new chapter. Even though it doesn't appear like Eddie will be traveling to Vegas, the fact that Nina will be in favor of the plan will be very important to him as well. When Eddie is under so much pressure from his loved ones to assume the identity of Ned once more, Nana's attitude will be a welcome change. It's understandable why Eddie will continue to regard Sonny and Nina as his buddies in the future. Eddie will receive a lot of love from Nana and Sonny, so he might decide to return the favor in the future. Remembering that Sonny and Nina are arranging a wedding, there is a significant likelihood that this will be the location of Nina's secret Tepoff's big revelation. When it comes to secrets being revealed on soap operas, wedding ceremonies are a frequent location. Eddie might offer to provide the entertainment in advance of Nina and Sonny's wedding. Even though Eddie became dizzy and stumbled while performing at the Savoy, he really shouldn't even be leaving the hospital at this time. Eddie ought to be prepared to rock and roll by the time Sonny and Nina are hitched. Since Sonny and Nina have done so much for him, Eddie might insist that he wants to give a spectacular performance as a wedding gift. Fans of General Hospital are aware that Ned's memories are the key to upsetting everything. So maybe Eddie will remember who he really is in time for a stunning twist. If Eddie steps up to the microphone and declares there won't be a wedding song after all, he might put on a spectacular show. When Sonny hears what Eddie has to say, he might even suggest that there won't be a wedding at all. After that, Ned might come out as himself once more and stun everyone in attendance. Is that the moment Ned will reveal Nina's deception and send the groom into shock. We'll see whether Nina's wedding day brings shocking news because that would be the perfect opportunity for Ned to drop the bombshell that she told on Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, and Drew Kane, Cameron Matheson, to the SEC. According to General Hospital teasers, Sonny will eventually learn more about the real story and will need to determine whether or not he still has a future with Nina. Sonny has a new housemate as Eddie enters the stage. Alexis Davis, Nancy Lee Gran, admitted that she only asked Diane Miller, Carolyn Hennessy, to come to the yoga studio because she believed Diane would be preoccupied with Robert Scorpio, Tristan Rogers. This was revealed in the General Hospital, GH. Spoilers recap for Monday, June 26. Diane denied having a love relationship with Robert and preferred to practice yoga as planned but Alexis persuaded her to go out for lunch instead. Robert, Laura Collins, Jenny Francis, and Felicia Scorpio, Christina Wagner, discovered Anna Devane, Finola Hughes, destroying old WSB records when they arrived at her home. Anna brought up the occasions that Robert had branded her a traitor, despite Robert's attempts to persuade her that she had atoned for her errors. Laura and Felicia dispatched Robert ahead to reserve a table for them at the Savoy since they were hoping to do so. After some thought, Anna decided she wanted to assist Laura on her trip to Chechnya. But Laura didn't think Anna running off like that would be a good look. Instead, Laura encouraged Anna by suggesting that she either discover a new route or allow one to come to her. As in Prince, Avery Pohl, in contrast, was taken aback by Spencer Cassidine's Nicholas Chavez, consideration for her. Essen was concerned that the tranquility wouldn't last because Laura and Kevin Collins, John Lindstrom, were about to go. Essen pretended to join Trina Robinson, Tabiana Ali, when she arrived with the intention of hanging around and watching TV with Spencer. Essen, however, 
quickly clarified that she was joking and announced that she would be going to bed when she had laid Ace Cassidine, Jay, and Joey Clay down. Esmond and Spencer were getting along, which confused Trina, but Spencer reassured her that he wasn't siding with his ex. Ace returned to the room to collect Ace's pacifier after Trina made a suggestion about Curtis Ashford, Donald alone, Turner, Spencer betraying to Trina Robinson, but she encouraged him to make the best of the situation until they could obtain concrete evidence against Esma. Spencer then had a memory flashback involving the evidence he had been keeping in his safe deposit box. Later, Esma interrupted again because Ace was fussing and she was unable to sing his favorite song as Spencer had done. Despite Spencer's concerns, Trina made the decision to depart and appeared to feel excluded from the co-parenting process. Ned Quartermain, also known as Eddie Main, Wally Kurth, introduced himself to Nina Reeves, Cynthia Watros, at the Savoy. She was shocked to see him leave the hospital. Eddie offered to buy Nina a drink and inquired about the types of musical acts that were scheduled at the Savoy. When Eddie later ran across Sonny Corintos, Maurice Bernard, and Michael Corintos, Chad Duell, they were able to verify for themselves that Ned wasn't making up his illness. Harrison Chase, Josh Swickard, looked into Ned's GH absence because Olivia Quartermain, Lisa Lo Cicero, Brooke Lynn Quartermain, Amanda Sen, and Tracy Quartermain, Jane Elliott, were all concerned. Harrison then discovered Ned's wallet on the ground. Olivia didn't pick up when Nina tried to call since she assumed it was a work-related call. Then Nina tried Brooke Lynn, who was able to inform the others that Ned was at the Savoy and provided updates on his whereabouts. Robert arrived at the nightclub and began bugging Sonny about how he treated Diane as Olivia texted Nina that they were on their way. After Diane arrived, she justified her working relationship with Sonny and drew Robert aside for a private discussion. Coming in second place behind Holly Sutton, Emma Soames, wasn't enough for Diane since she insisted she wasn't the kind of woman who would allow herself to be selected automatically. Eddie stepped up on stage with a guitar and wanted to perform because the opening act was unable to make it. Eddie staggered until Chase assisted him in finding a chair elsewhere when he became too dizzy to stand. Although Eddie eventually snapped at Olivia, he ultimately felt bad for the suffering she was experiencing. As Olivia realized Eddie couldn't love someone he didn't know, she sobbed. Sonny promised Olivia he'd take Ned back to his penthouse, when Eddie refused to return to the Quartermain estate or allow Olivia to place him in a suite. That news obviously upset Nina, as evidenced by her expression. Stay tuned to the ABC soap as Eddie will continue to give Nina problems, according to General Hospital teasers. Summary Eddie Main tries to make his Savoy debut on General Hospital. Nettie makes the decision to become the Savoy opening act, According to the General Hospital Recap Highlights of the General Hospital Recap In this episode, as his family gasped in terror, Nettie made an attempt to go full Eddie Main. Nettie liked Sonny and Nina as well. While Robert had a tense encounter with Diane, Laura, and Felicia did their utmost to persuade Anna to quit feeling sorry for herself. Essen kept getting in the way of Trina and Spencer enjoying a night in. Let's now delve a little more deeply into the specifics. Recap of General Hospital. Eddie Main meets new people. Nettie, Wally Kurth, appeared behind Nina, Cynthia Watros, and informed her that she was the woman he had been looking for as they spoke on the phone about Drew's, Cameron Matheson, case. At first, Nina panicked, but it turned out that Nettie merely wanted to have a drink and talk about the music scene in Port Charles. Nina was relieved when he introduced himself as Eddie. Ari aid this to learn more about UPC OMI General Hospital EV ENT. Sonny, Morris Bernard, was unsure about how to react when he saw Nina and Nettie together, so he inserted himself into their conversation. While Nina talked to Olivia on the phone, Sonny, Morris Bernard, insisted on getting Nettie a drink so they could discuss music. Olivia, Lisa Lo Cicero, naturally declined to respond, so she next attempted Brooke Lynn, Amanda Sen. 
At least BLQ answered the Robert phone and Tristan Rogers interrupted Sonny to discuss Diane, Carolyn Hennessy. As it happened, Diane and Alexis, Nancy Lee Gran, arrived and overheard the dialogue at that point. When Eddie Main made his Savoy stage debut, Diane went Robert to talk to him alone. However, they didn't go very far, but he almost fainted before he could finish a song. Sunny was charged with calming Olivia down after this caused her to go into more fits of hysteria. He said that Nettie is being pressured by too many people to become someone he doesn't recall, which caused Olivia to pause. To that purpose, she made an effort to speak with Nettie, without placing any pressure on him, but it didn't work out so well because Olivia is incapable of acting calmly. Nettie eventually consented to accompany Sunny home. GH Recap Anna is completely uncertain about her future while visiting Anna, Finola Hughes, to convince her to spend the night at the Savoy, Laura, Jenny Francis, Felicia, Christina Wagner, and Robert discovered her burning items from her former life as a spy. She didn't care about the interruption. All she wanted was some privacy. Her pals were impatient to get her out of the house and didn't care. Anna didn't care that it turned out to be Valentine's, James Patrick Stewart, idea for the whole thing. In order for Laura and Felicia to talk to Anna privately, Laura finally requested that Robert leave. Anna acknowledged that this was more about what she thought of herself than what other people thought of her. She believed that her employment with the WSB provided a counterbalance to her actions with the DVX, but now that opportunity had been taken away. Anna ultimately made the decision to travel to Russia with Laura and Valentin in order to give herself some direction. Laura tried her best to dissuade Anna from that thought while assuring her that she would find a new direction in life. Recap of General Hospital Esme manipulates with Ace. Esme, Avery Kristen Pohl, and Spencer, Nicholas Alexander Chavez, became close over baby Ace, Jay, and Joey Clay. But Esme was concerned about what would happen if Laura and Kevin, John Lindstrom, traveled to Russia to locate Nicholas. Esme was annoyed by Trina's, Tabiana Ali, attempt to get Spencer to spend an evening with her after she abruptly interrupted with a knock on the door. Esme politely ducked out, and Trina acknowledged that it was strange to see Spencer and Esme getting along. After a short period of time alone, they talked about Trina's dysfunctional family. Trina tried to give Esme some baby advice when she entered the room to get Ace's binky. When Trina and Spencer were alone once more, Esme was not having it and vowed to gather solid proof to put her in jail. Trina made the decision to depart after Esme repeatedly interrupted to persuade Spencer to sing to Ace, assuring herself that Esme wouldn't stay in their lives forever. She saw what appeared to be a family scenario involving Ace, Esme, and Spencer just before she left the room. Thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.